Here's your WNEM TV5 news update. Good morning, everyone. I'm Ashlyn Hill. Here's a look at the top stories we're following today. A sad update to report about a Detroit firefighter who vanished while helping save three girls from drowning. Crews say they recovered his body. Detroit Fire Sergeant Savad Johnson was pulled from the water yesterday afternoon following a six hour search. On Friday, Johnson was off duty with his 10 year old daughter when they heard young girls screaming for help. Johnson jumped in to help rescue them, but vanished in the water after saving the girls. The House has passed a bill to give the U.S. Postal Service $25 billion and reverse operational changes that have slowed down the mail. 26 Republicans defied President Trump and GOP leaders and voted with Democrats on the bill, but their Senate colleagues are unlikely to take up the measure. Democrats and some others are concerned recent Postal Service's changes will harm mail-in voting. Although the Postmaster General is a vocal Trump supporter, he says the agency will handle the election efficiently and fairly. The Republican National Convention kicks off tomorrow night. A GOP official told CNN that the president is expected to give a short speech. He'll formally accept the nomination at the White House Thursday. The event's theme is honoring the great American story with featured speakers each night. You can watch all four nights of the convention live right here on TV5 starting at 10. And now joining us, we've got meteorologist John Gross with a look at our forecast. All right, here's a look at your WNEM TV5 weather update. It's going to be another hot and humid day to end out the weekend. Isolated storm chances will also continue throughout this afternoon. Temperatures near 90 today, partly to mostly sunny if you're not experiencing the rain shower activity. Also, the humidity tracker for today, it's definitely going to be enough to notice it as you're stepping out the door. Dew points expected to be into the lower to mid 60s for your Sunday. Tonight, it's down into the mid 60s. Any thunderstorm activity that we had early on will start to dissipate overnight. Partly cloudy skies will take us into the beginning of a new week. And it continues to stay hot and humid into next week. So a warm and unstable air mass will prove chances for some more isolated showers and thunderstorms throughout most of next week with temperatures holding into the mid to upper 80s. We'll have to watch the tropics and see what happens for some more shower and thunderstorm development for our forecast, especially around Thursday and Friday. And it looks like some more relief comes in for the weekend. And upper 70s, more sunshine and less humidity. And the first one five weather center, the meteorologist John Gross. Remember to tune into WNEM TV5 on air and online 24-7 for the latest news, weather, and information.